So we're going to work on your hips helping to lead that beginning of your swing. Okay, so when you're in your back swing, we don't want you to come through with the arm first because that's, I think, one of the things that's really making that tingling happen. So if you forget what we want to do, just say, oh, I'm going to work on the back swing so I know my arm needs to be here, kind of here. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to get over there, you're going to get your weight on that right foot. And you can, you know, keep that tap down if you want to, or kind of hold it up, whatever you want. And you're just going to sink down into that hip. Okay, I can really feel a lot of work happening right here. So maybe 10 or so times, okay? Then what you're going to do is you're going to think, this is what I need my hips to do to lead that swing, okay? You can practice it with your left foot lightly down. You can practice it with your left foot moving to kind of clear the path a little bit. Then for like a uh, right out on the course kind of thing, we're going to have you try this. We're going to have you go with that golf club in your left hand. I think you liked that better. We're going to do, whoa, we're going to do this. So ideally, if you can kind of think about timing it so the foot comes back first, then the, then the arm goes through. So you could do it kind of slow at first, and then you could start to speed it up as you get comfortable with that. Okay? <laughs> That's that.